Hi everyone, it's Natalie here, and I would said to uh, Mina over at Shuffle Tarot, who enjoyed my, my hashtag um, tea topic treat and tarot, that she uh, thought it could be a regular thing. And I said, well, let's see how that goes when I come home from teaching third graders all day long on a Tuesday. So today, folks, I have my tea, which is orange sparkling water from Schnooks. And woo, boy, that feels good. And uh, today, my treat, which is going to be some liquid ibuprofen. Because guess who's aching a little bit everywhere right now? And uh, the topic, that was way more water than I expected. <laughs> I've been home and walked the dog and washed the dishes and changed clothes and done all of that. So it's all good. Um, I did come home today and find uh, amazingly that um, something, oops, hello. So something had arrived from Schiffer and I have not ordered anything. So there's only one thing that this can really mean, which is either that they made a mistake or they have sent me uh, the next edition of the Mariel Tarot. So oh, I, I figured, what the hell, after a long day, what could be better, more fun than talking to your friends virtually, even though they can't respond directly to what you're saying um, and <clears throat> opening this to see what's inside. So... Uh, amazingly, they just kind of shoved it, but I don't normally get things sent to my home address because we have a lot of porch pirates here. So they had hidden it behind a flower pot. God bless them. So. And later on tonight, while I'm, once we've kind of <clears throat> managed, well, once I've done this, really, I've got to get to finishing all the paperwork that I'm doing for a an online writing class that I'm teaching that is for a very large university who will, I'm sure, not want any kind of mention on the riffraff that I do here. <laughs> um, because, yeah, but they, they hold... Sorry, I'm all over the shop here. What's up? Long day. Um, but they, uh, yeah... They are running a writing course or a program for gifted children, and um, they pay way better than any of the universities or subbing situations that I've ever been a part of. And so I'm going to work for them and supplement my income that way as well. But unfortunately, they've given me uh, like an almost 40 hours week worth of work to do right before starting the classes on the 23rd next week next Monday because uh, I don't know they just didn't have everything together in time anyway um, what do we have here Ooh. yeah it's the Marielle that's interesting the billing address is Marie White. It's it's hers. Um, which I did not expect to see there. Yeah, wow. So this is the Marielle. And it is wrapped in this white paper. Um, this is going to be very interesting indeed. surprise they didn't send an email or anything kind of saying like hey you can expect this to show up or we're, we're reissuing this and sending it to you or anything um, 
I'm curious to know if anybody else has gotten one. I knew that they were going to be sending out a new edition of it. I'm just so curious to see what's changed. Okay, so same kind of box. Actually, let me go get the other one's box and uh, we'll do a little side by side. Hang on one sec. Okay, so I'm back and I've got, I just realized my shoulders were being worn like earrings from woo, third graders all day long. Um, <laughs> they were actually really good. Um, but yeah, so these are my old Marielle cards. My, well, my old, my since May heavily used second edition Marielle cards. Um, who have become my very dear friend. I love them very much. We work together every day. Mm. They're great for working with clients. Wow, bubble water. Love that. Okay, so yeah, this is the uh, first box that I got of the second edition on top and the new one on bottom. Pretty much, I think they're pretty identical. I'm not seeing any major differences of any kind. Um, so that should mean that this one will open the same way. Yep. Little magnets here. Um, yeah, they've, they're still, they didn't take any feedback from anyone about this thing. Like, why is that there? But that's okay. Um, and you know what I'm going to do is tilt this down. This is so, like, not planned. I did not plan this today, but here we are, so we may as well. Um, so here's the book. What's happening with my... There we go. I was like, why is it so dim? So anyway, there's the book. And, aha! They came up with a solution. Although, look at that. Already that thing, like, what's going on? the Schiffer. But these are not scattered everywhere because now they are, they did change this. They did change the insert. Let me just look at the first insert. Um, yeah, look at that. So I left the fun little piece of cart wrapped up paper in there. So the first insert was not constructed oops, as well, like on the bottom, as you can see. And get back in there, bud. Um, this ridiculous whatever um, that goes there. Right, so there's that. This one. Oh, look at that. They were supposed to tape it down to the bottom, and they didn't. <laughs> oh, how funny. So technically this, and I'm not going to, but that's, that's an adhesive strip. That should have been stripped to the bottom. Interesting. Well, you know, when we get freaked out and people are worried about doing a good job, you know, mistakes get made. Uh, things get overlooked. I'll be interested to know. But this is much sturdier and this is a good solution. You know, oh, oh, people look with this. Oh, oh my goodness. There's going to be a different card situation in here. Um, the book shouldn't have changed at all. I'm just delaying here because it's, it's so nice. I got to do the, oh, it smells so good. Okay, I had to do that. I love the way these things smell. Um, yeah, this is silver gilding on this one. Well, how do you do? All right, let me just, uh, I'm just going to do the old tooth thing here. Don't mind me. <laughs> We'll need to get some. Oh, it's not the droids we're looking for. Okay, that's my cell phone. Okay. I don't want to destroy any of this. Come on. Went to all this trouble to get the new ones printed. Okay, that should give me enough for 
large. They are really firmly inside. This is not your average, like, cheap-ass plastic. Um, oh, interesting. I have to, I just have to sniff. It's, it's a thing. Okay. Ooh. So they're in the, ooh. Um, yeah, well, this is beautiful. Um, wow. Ooh, psychedelic Xanadu. Um, interesting. You know, I have, I was not expecting the silver, but I wonder if that'll hold up better than the black. My black is rubbed off really fast. I might have to sharpie it. But that silver, that's like, Psychedelic silver. I'm gonna have to like uh, separate. There we go. Oh, it's it is kind of nice. It's kind of, but it is the same cardstock. Yeah, same cardstock. Let's flip them the same. There we go. Same cardstock. Different <laughs> edging. Um, the gilding and the way that the cards were cut out and gilded makes it look a little thicker, but I'm, I'm, oh, wait, there are some differences. There is a coating on these that is not on this edition. Okay, so you can tell there's going to be like, <laughs> there's going to be all sorts of like response videos to this. Um... I want to risk mixing my decks up here. Yeah, there's some kind of plastication. These have been plastic, plasticized somehow. They're not quite the same cardstock. Uh, I dare say this is maybe a little better. Um, yeah, this is definitely an improvement. Wow. Um, Yeah, eight is just this little. I'm like, wait, is that stuck together? Nope. Wow, I'm impressed. Um, it is, it is a very, it, they're a lot slipperier. And yeah, there's some kind of a difference. They're about the same thickness. I don't feel like there's any real difference in the thickness of these cards. Um, just see, these have been fluffed because of being used and shuffled so much. They're a little fluffy, but... Um, yeah, I'm going to say they're about the same thickness. Um, gosh, I, don't, I couldn't guess, really. I don't... I mean, I'm not that precise. I kind of have a sense or I'm getting a, a greater sense of like what the GSM thickness weights feel like. Um, you know, 220, 221, whatever it takes. Um, anyone who knows Mr. Mom. Um, but yeah, the, the uh, it's a little joke about electric wiring in the US. Um, and how, like, one of the dudes in the movie clearly knows nothing and the other one does. Anyway, yeah, I want to say, I mean, it's thicker than, like, a standard U.S. games. It's nowhere near as thick as the old deck. Oh, they do feel good, though, guys. They do feel really good. They're a little bit rough. I don't know if this will be picked up. Um, the death card. Ooh, um... They are like the edge. I don't know if that's going to show up or not, but like the under, you know, the back, the edge is kind of up. You can feel it. It's like, I don't know how to describe it. It's raised a little bit at the edges. Yeah. I have to watch this back to see how well that's coming out. But anyway, so they're like, smooth going this direction but go this direction and it's like there's a little bit of a blade there 
Um, very interesting. Very, very interesting. I dare say um, these will be a much more like pleasant and delightful experience to shuffle. They're already like a nice handling experience. Oh, if I could get my shoulders out down from around my ears, it would be even better. Oh, and they're all in the order that she puts them in. I love her. Oh, I love Marie White. Yeah, just like when you get gilding in any deck, you know, there's always a few that are stuck together a little. This is so North Carolina. It's so funny to me that she lives there because the first time I saw this, I thought, wow, I'm sure I've seen that somewhere. And I thought maybe somewhere up in the Appalachian Mountains in North Carolina. And that's, of course, that's where she lives. Yeah, threes and fours. Yeah, there's a really nice texture going on with these. Just getting them all separated out. Yeah, there we go. So I really just want to shuffle them. They do feel really good. Um, it'll be, yeah, there's even, I don't know, you won't be able to see this. I need to get out my really good camera and do the angle, you know. Which, of course, I'm going to do because, duh. So I have to get all my homework done first. That's going to have to happen. Oh, hello, sweethearts. God, I love this deck. Okay, and there's our... Oh, no! Oh, God! King of Pentacles, every stinking deck. Why, 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 why? What is that? Is that just... Why does that happen in every single one? And this is the complimentary one. No. Yeah, it's like all... It's all chewed. Oh, that's so frustrating. I don't know. As heavily as I use this deck, you know, it's going to end up trashed anyway. It's just nice when you can at least start with a completely clean deck, you know. Wow, I've never had... This is my first Silver Gilded. All right. Okay, not yet ready for the uh, the bridge. Wow, this might actually hold up. It'll take a while to be able to bridge comfortably. So there's that direction. I'm going to say it's a pretty smooth shuffle. feels good. Um, wow. So, hi again. Um, <clears throat> yeah, wow. Beautiful deck. Beautiful. Very different. Very, very different. Look at that glow. Yeah, so... I'll probably put this one away. <laughs> and really properly wear out my my first second edition uh, before pulling these guys out for use but um, how cool I'm really I'm you know it's an improvement there's some improvements here major ones at least I have a nice new clean copy of this one um, it's gonna smell really good um, so yeah very interesting. And it looks like the way that this has been made 
they're intending for you to be able to store your cards in the box. Although, you know, because then you can just pull them out this way. But like, I don't know. I mean, really, if they want to create a product like that, they're going to have to do better. You know, I'm probably at some point will take all of that out of there. Um, and I don't know. I'm, I think I'm going to hold on to these magnetic boxes because I can always cover them with other paper and turn them into, you know, other things that have better use. So I've never thrown them out. But this will be my... Maybe fifth copy of Muriel. It's only my second copy of the, of the second edition, but I, it's a deck that, I, you know, I wanted a backup copy of the first edition and then... Anyway, it, we know how it turned out. So I've got a, a good backup, backup copy of the first edition for whatever I may need it for. But um, I'm using the second edition so much now that I don't really feel a need to do more of that. Anyway, so there we are. That was fun. Cheers, everybody. And um, I'll, see you, I'll see you soon, I'm sure. <laughs> do another cup of tea and a chat. But of course, this one was like not what we were expecting. It's way longer. So hope you're comfortable where you are. It is super hot in St. Louis. And um, there we go. All right, everybody. Thank you so, so much for watching and for being here.